So for me, what makes EPCS special is the class sizes especially. They're very small and I visited lots of other sixth forms before coming here and I found that, especially for maths, there was often two classes of 30 each, whereas here it's only 12 and for further maths, four. So it gives a really personalised experience and you can get lots of help from your teacher and you don't have to be afraid to ask questions. It's really comforting knowing that you have that support. I would say also because we have a small cohort, everyone in year 12 and 13 knows each other by names, so you don't feel like your sixth form is just a bunch of strangers, you actually know one another and as well your teacher and head of sixth form gets to know you personally and especially my head of sixth form because they knew me personally they were able to give me advice about my future career plans and it really did help me. Uh, before I joined sixth form I already had an idea of what I would like to do afterwards. I've always had my headset at becoming a maths teacher or even possibly continuing on to become a lecturer. So I had a lot of support from my head of sixth form on this career pathway but he also offered and showed me other possibilities that broadened the field of mathematics but only cemented my dreams of becoming a maths teacher. Yes, yeah, so like Sasha, I knew what I wanted to study after sixth form, and that was aerospace engineering. So I was able to choose my subjects around those, and I suppose taking those subjects really does help you get there. And I've really developed a passion and curiosity for my subjects, and that's what really solidified me to go into aerospace rather than a different aspect of engineering. Yeah, and so I gained opportunities such as visiting Rolls-Royce and attending open days. And I spoke to even uh, some engineers from Rolls-Royce that really solidified what I wanted to do. Of course, there's the social side to sixth form, which is great. It really helps you relax from the stressful studies that, <laughs> that we're all going through. Yeah. So, for example, every Wednesday, period four, we take part in something called enrichment. Uh, for example, I took part in a lot of the sports that was offered. So, football, badminton, and even running in the meadows just mm -hmm. by the school. But I know lots of my friends took part in things like cooking, even yoga, some people yeah. did. Um, yes, uh, I'd say sixth form is around 70% academic and 30% extracurricular because as soon as we joined year 12, uh, both of us decided to join the head team and became deputies for our houses. So that involved a lot of responsibilities. We had to plan assemblies for the houses, deliver them, which is very frightening, in front of a massive crowd and all the fundraising events that we had to plan and carry out. Um, some of the most notable ones, definitely the Festival of Light, yep. that was quite a big success, and um, Neon Night and Leavers Ball, all the sixth form socials as well.